What is good everybody and welcome back to another My Damn Toys video. Today we have the very first edition of the MDT Wrestling Observer and in this show we are going to talk about every rumor and everything that is surrounding MDT Live and Vindication. Today's episode we're going to talk about MDT Live Episode 4 and it has been confirmed that Episode 4 of MDT Live will be released this week in the next few days or so so be on the lookout for that. On this show, we will cover every rumor and confirmed match for upcoming episodes of the Pick Fed. I hope you guys do enjoy this series. Let me know down in the comment section below if you enjoy it. I will be talking about a uh, spreadsheet full of rumors I have right here in front of me surrounding the Pick Fed and the show. Today's episode is only involving episode 4 of MDC Live, so I hope you guys enjoy. Let's get started. The first rumor I have for you guys is that Eric Bischoff might be returning to MDT Live this week. As we know, Eric Bischoff has not been seen since Episode 3 of MDT Live, the go-home show for MDT Blackout. He was RKO'd and then punted by Randy Orton before the show was over, and that is the last time we saw Eric Bischoff. But it has been said it is hot on the rumor mill that he will be back this week to speak to the MDT Universe. However, it has not yet been confirmed. Up next on this episode, guys, it has been confirmed by multiple sources surrounding MDT Wrestling that the next MDT pay-per-view will be MDT Money in the Bank. We have quite a few episodes of MDT Live and Vindication to occur before this pay-per-view, but it has been confirmed that Money in the Bank is on the horizon. We do not yet know any um, official things about the pay-per-view except that there will be two Money in the Bank matches on this pay-per-view, one for MDT Live and one for Vindication in which six participants on each show will participate. The first matchup rumor we have right here, guys, is that apparently Extreme Champion RVD will be taking on Jack Swagger this week on MDT Live Episode 4. We do not know the exact implications of the matchup, but there are rumors going around that this could be a Money in the Bank qualifier and the title could be on the line. We do not know exactly, but that is the rumor that has been going around the company. RVD taking on Jack Swagger. Should be an exciting one. Up next, guys, we have some rumors surrounding this matchup right here. Shelton Benjamin taking on Dolph Ziggler. We do not know if this match will be taking place this week. However, we do know that Shelton Benjamin was attacked at MDT Blackout from behind and not. He was ruled unable to compete in his United States Championship rematch at Blackout. He was attacked from behind, slammed through the locker room table. So we do not know anything about that just yet. But this is a matchup that is also rumored to take place this week. Ziggler taking on Benjamin. And I would guess this would probably be a Money in the Bank qualifier. If RVD and Jack Swagger is a qualifier, you would only uh, assume that this would also be a qualifying matchup. Another rumor going around, guys, is that AJ Styles will be in a Money in the Bank qualifier this week, but we do not know who his opponent will be. It is a mystery at this moment, but hopefully we will find out on MDT Live Episode 4. AJ Styles has not competed in a match since the Episode 1 of MDT Live where he lost that Fatal 4-Way ladder match to Edge along with Roman Reigns and CM Punk. I would love if CM Punk was the mystery opponent, but we will not know until this week's episode of MDT Live. But I'm so excited to finally see AJ Styles compete in the ring for the first time in a while. The last rumor we have for you guys today on the MDT Observer is that Randy Orton may not be the opponent for Edge going into Money in the Bank. It has been rumored that Randy Orton may be suspended for an indefinite, um, indefinite amount of time. And if that is true, that means that he could not be the opponent for Edge at Money in the Bank. So hopefully, um, we will find out who that opponent will be. And if it is not Randy Orton, where does this leave him going forward in this company? But that is all the rumors we have for you guys today. I hope you guys did enjoy this episode of the MDT Observer. I hope that um, you guys continue to enjoy this series going forward. Um, I enjoyed the rumor mill like this. I like to give you guys sort of an in-depth look at what is to come in the pick fed. If you did enjoy, please leave a like. Leave a comment down below. Um, if you like this series or not, subscribe for more epic WWE and WWE figure-related videos. Again, take all of this with a grain of salt, guys. These are not all confirmed rumors. This, I will tell you if these things are confirmed. Who knows whether any of this stuff is true. So I hope you guys did enjoy. See you guys in the next video.